Hey guys, Rick Queen here with the new Lego Advent Calendar pictures to share with you guys. You may have already seen these before, but I figured I'd share my thoughts anyway. So we have four Advent Calendars this year, and the new one being Harry Potter. Um, this is our first year getting a Harry Potter Advent Calendar, and I, for one, think that's awesome. This is going to be the one that I get. I don't know if I'll get any of the others. Right now, I'm really just planning on getting the Harry Potter Advent Calendar because... It's the first time we're getting a Harry Potter advent calendar. Uh, but anyway, um, the stuff that's in it does look pretty cool. I know this is just the back of the box right now, uh, but we do have pictures of what's actually in it. Um, there's like a uh, miniature Hogwarts Express, and you know, you have Flitwick in there, and Dumbledore, and McGonagall. You also have Ron, Harry, and Hermione. Um, so I think it's just a really cute um, advent calendar. Uh, and I'm just glad that we're getting, you know, something new. I, for one, think that it would be a great idea for them to, like, switch out themes every year instead of having, you know, Star Wars, City, and Friends every year. You have those three every year. I would like to see them change it up some more, personally. But anyway, I am excited to get the Harry Potter one. At least that is something new and looks like it's going to be pretty good. Um, I, for one, just love Harry Potter, so I'm going to get all of them, uh, all the Harry Potter stuff, that is. Um, I love that they're they're giving them their little, little Christmas shirts with the H and the R on there. I think that's awesome, but I can't wait to get that advent calendar. I think it's going to be great. Now, as for stuff that you know, we're a little bit more used to seeing um, the Star Wars Advent Calendar, which, I don't know, stores may even be selling this one. I feel like I've seen it before. Um, I could be wrong. Maybe I haven't, <laughs> but it feels like I've seen it. Anyway, um, it I mean, it's not a bad one by any means. Uh, I, I definitely do like the, the little Santa uh, Porg <laughs> in this. I think that's pretty adorable. Um, they even changed out the colors on the porg to make it look more Christmassy. So that's kind of cute. You even have like a, a Christmas gonk droid in this. So, I mean, it's not horrible, but I mean, it's a, it's a good set if you like Star Wars. I just would like to see, you know, them change it up a bit. Give us some different themes. We've had Star Wars advent calendars for years. Why not make a... Uh, Jurassic Park advent calendar or a Monster Fighters advent calendar, um, a Ninjago advent calendar, superheroes, something else. Um, I think it would be awesome if they changed it out every year and just gave us like, you know, one or two every year and just changed it up. You know, what themes they have this year and next year, you know, anyway just my thoughts on that, but I digress. Um, anyway, that I think is the last picture for Star Wars. Then we have the Friends Advent Calendar, which, you know, it's it's not a bad calendar. Um, actually, there's, there's some pretty cute stuff in there, um, but it, I mean, Friends is pretty girly, um, but not to say that, you know, nobody else can like it. It's just kind of got a you know, really like pinks and purples and, you know, pastels, more or less, uh, to really get into the Friends Advent Calendar. Um, and despite the fact that I think, you know, there's some cute stuff included in this, I doubt I will get this one, um, just because I'm just not a huge uh, Friends fan. I mean, like I said, I do like some of the stuff in it. I like the stockings. Um, you know, they're, like, it's, there's just some cute stuff in there, but anyway, um, then we also have the city advent calendar, which, again, we get, you know, a city advent calendar every year, and I feel like the city one is the one that kind of changes the least. It feels like, you know, they just change the package every year. Um, it's just more or less a different box. They might change out a few things in it, like, this one, I think it, it kind of even has like, I don't know if it's supposed to be curling or some other kind of, you know, sport like that. But so 
I mean, there's a few things that are kind of different in it, but you know in city you're going to get like the standard Santa Claus and, you know, just some, some basic things. Uh, there is actually a, uh, I think it's a grandfather clock um, included, so that's kind of nice. I do like that. Um, the minifigures are okay in it. I don't think there's anything super fancy in this, but anyway... Um, I just wanted to share all the advent calendars with you guys and see your thoughts. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And if you still want me to make custom advent calendars, be sure to let me know.